Okay, hello YouTube. Today I'm going to show you how to jailbreak any device that's running 5.1.1 and under. Okay? Well, not really any device, but iPod Touch. Okay, this is the fourth generation. See the front camera. And this is the rear camera too. Okay, this is run, running iOS 4.2.1. See? And using Red Snow. Latest version, which is 0.9.15b3. Okay? Now what you're going to do is make sure your device is off. It'll make the disconnecting sound on your computer, okay? Okay, now you're gonna have Red Snow open and you're gonna click next, okay? And I'm gonna do the steps. Press and hold the power button for three seconds. Without letting go of the power button, press and hold the home button for like as long as it tells you. Without releasing that power, or without releasing the home button, release the power button for 15 seconds. Okay, now I'm successfully in DFU no mode. This isn't pwned DFU mode. Okay. Okay, now this is gonna happen. Exploring with Lime Rain and upload the first stage, second stage, patching kernel. All that kind of stuff. Waiting for reboot. Identifying build. Okay. Preparing jailbreak data. Yes, yes, yes. If you have noticed, this isn't my normal computer because my computer right now has viruses because some douchebag decided to put viruses in my computer. So it's under, right, currently it is under work over there on my table. Okay, right now it's doing this defragmenter and the advanced virus and all that kind of shit, you know. Okay, once that is done, your iPod should look like this. Okay, it's, the screen's just black, but it's on, but it's black. Okay. Please select options for iPod 4.1, blah, 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 okay? Make sure install Cydia and enable battery percentage, because that's cool. iPod does not have battery percentage, iPhone does, okay? Okay. If you could, if you have a custom bundle on your computer, install a custom bundle. Otherwise, click next. Wait, while well, being processed, and then I'll have to do some shit on here. It says downloading jailbreak data. And it has some stuff going on here, like RAM disk, uploading kernel, rebooting. Okay, it's in the matrix mode, is what people call it, and it sounds, seems kind of cool. It just shows everything that's going on it. On here, it says done when it's doing this, just so you know. Okay. The rest of, and it also says the rest of this process is taking place on your device. Okay. It takes about maybe about five minutes or so. Now it goes to here. Move, it's putting everything on here. Okay. And if you're running iOS 5.1.1 and only 5.1.1. You can do this process without entering DFU mode, okay? Or as my friend calls it, definitely dot mode. Which is, um, it's, it's, it's I think it stands for like device factory upload or something. Not sure. You can fast forward, but like, until the dev team logo disappears. Here, you watch TV. It's SpongeBob and stuff. Right now, my iPad says installing bundles. Okay. Yes. 
Now that that process is done, it's gonna reboot your device, okay? You shouldn't lose anything, but make sure you do back up before. Yes, yes. A text message. Okay, got a text on Okay. It's my cool ringtone. This it's like th like this is and we say Sparta, you know, from the movie three hundred. But instead of Sparta, he says a text message. It's like this is a text message. It's gonna take a while. If you notice, I'm recording this iPod with another iPod. I also have another iPod in my pocket. And there's my phone. Right now, I'm the go-to guy for jailbreaking because I do it for free currently for a limited time. Only. That's my mom. Okay, fast forward until this Apple logo disappears. That's when I just want to hear me talk, but you know. I'm bored just waiting. Once you do that, you're just gonna wanna go to back extras and select IPSW, okay? And then you select the IPSW you downloaded, which you should have, which is one that matches your firmware, and then it does all that stuff. Then you have Cydia, okay? Thanks, bye.